Nurses on the front lines of the COVID-19 pandemic put themselves at risk every day to help those who are sick. And for pregnant nurses, well, they face unique challenges, as many of them fear they're putting their unborn child at risk. Fox 12 Sarah Hurwitz is live now from our mobile newsroom, sharing the story of one pregnant nurse working in the ER of a Salem hospital. A challenging situation for her, Sarah. Absolutely. She has a lot on her mind right now. Hannah Wildhaber is in her first nursing job, and she says she is constantly thinking about how potential exposure could impact the health of her first child. This as she is taking care of many, many who might have COVID-19. Every shift for Hannah Wildhaber comes with stress, anxiety, and questions. It's hard to know, like, if they have the virus or not. And, you know, when I walk out, I'm like, oh my gosh, like, I have to, you know, wash everything. Wildhopper is just a year and a half into her first nursing job at Salem Health Hospital's emergency room. She's also pregnant, expecting her first child in September. She says she's seen a lot of patients with similar symptoms to COVID-19, but she says it's hard to know for sure because oftentimes they see patients with similar symptoms in the ER. Is this person short of breath because they have congestive heart failure or they have asthma or they have COPD or do they have COVID-19. You get a patient, you have them for maybe four hours, maybe five hours, you discharge them home or you send them to the floor. And then after that, you're already getting a new patient. So it's like by the time you come back to work the next day, you almost are like, I don't even know how to check up and see if they tested positive because I've had like 10 patients since then. Wild Haber says testing for COVID-19 is often done after they see a patient because their focus in the ER is quick treatment. So it is very much triage, very much like stabilize, get done what's emergent in the situation. In the midst of treating patient after patient who might have COVID-19, Hannah Wild Haber is pregnant. If I weren't pregnant, I kind of have the personality that's like, I'll be fine, you know, like I'm healthy, it'll be okay. But, um, you know, being pregnant makes me a lot more stressed out. She says she's trying to stay calm and keep perspective in all of this. I feel so lucky every single day to be pregnant regardless of the situation. But there are things I thought would be much different. Um, as far as even like, you know, I'm going to find out the gender soon and that ultrasound keeps getting canceled. She says her husband won't be able to be there for those upcoming appointments because of COVID-19 regulations. He's the, the father of my child. Like I want him to be there. I want him to see that. I want him to experience that. But she realizes the time that we're living in and understands what she signed up for as a nurse. You know, you're going to be taking care of people with infectious diseases. But you don't really think like, but I'm going to be a first time mom in my first year and a half of my career working in a pandemic. And she is hoping that with COVID-19 regulations that her husband will at least be able to be there in that room when she delivers their first child. Opening life here from the mobile newsroom, Sarah Horwitz, Fox 12 Oregon.